So, what's up guys? I am back again with another video. This time it's about true love. And it's in the appreci in appreciation of it. Uh, a lot of people just think that just because you love somebody, you're, the other person didn't love you back. Unfortunately, not every case is like that. Um, it's a lot of things that go into this. And unfortunately, nowadays people are hurt. And they feel like if they were hurt, they got to hurt other people. Okay. Um, true love leads to where one person is in love. And is willing to do the most beautiful things for that person not stupid things now take this in mind nothing stupid stupidness i can say an obsession is different than uh than love love you will do as much as possible in your hands to make that person happy now if you're trying to force that person into a relationship that is no love that's an obsession now um we have had issues where a lot of people try to go in and just because they're in love with one person, they've run out of the house, they've, um, they got into real fights. And unfortunately, things are different when you're protecting somebody you love, which is true love, and protecting an obsession. An obsession will lead you to do stupid ass things. Protecting true love will be make you smarter and know what to do in those situations. Um, so yeah, don't confuse the two things, an obsession and a true love. Because true love will eventually start rising between both of y'all. She will start feeling the same thing, or he will start feeling the same thing. And two people will come together. So, that's what normally happens. Now... If the other person does not appreciate what you're doing for them, it's going to hurt. But it's not always going to happen. People nowadays, if they are hurt, they feel like they are have the ability now to hurt other people. Even the people who truly love them. Okay? Um... I'm not going to say especially for men, especially for women, because both of sides do this. If a woman hurts a guy, and a guy feels hurt, he's going to start acting up if after his own choice. He's the one who chooses, or she's the one who chooses if they're going to hurt other people. But nowadays, people are just so into emotional distress that they are willing to hurt other people that are trying to give them love because they were hurt. Women, the same thing, specifically when they are, let's say, they're looking for the perfect body. They have the bo perfect body shape. They are thinking just because they were hurt, they have the right, or guys as well, because they have the, oh, look, I have a good shape, or this and that. I'm, I'm willing to have any girl, any guy, or any girl's going to go, I have any guy, and then I'm just going to dump, dump up, because that's going to take the pain away. No, it's not. It's just going to create it longer. It's going gonna, it's gonna to make it bigger. And it's going to make the other person the same thing as you. And then people go, uh, women and guys go, there's no other, no good woman out there. There's no good guys out there. There is. Step, you go for the guys who are going to treat you like shit, to be honest. Guys, the same thing. You go for the girls who are going to treat you like shit. So, it's no longer just... Oh, she's treating me bad, or she's, or he's treating me bad. It's now that you are just falling into the same ecosystem as them. So if you're doing bad, people are gonna treat you bad too because you're mistreating the good guys and or the good girls and going for the bad guys, bad girls. You know what I mean? So it's gonna be way more different if you truly love that person and that person has at least a beautiful feeling for you as if they care for you. One thing that you can always do, and they're going to say, please don't ask me this. What would happen if the day of tomorrow, I would be gone? They take too long to answer. They don't answer. That person doesn't care about you. 
it's not going to be always like that but if they take too long a little bit long and then they and then sometimes they say quickly well I'll be here looking for you that person really cares about you it's not that they're going to go out of their way around the world no just showing you that they're willing to be here for you okay if a person's been there through the hard and the good times appreciate them because not many people will do that no more People are now just looking for sex. Sex is... It's nice. I'm not going to say it's not. But it does not define true love. I've known a lot of people who've been hurt. And me as someone who cares about people, I've gone through a great deal of repairing them. And I don't say as if there were to be something to be fixed, if they were bro if they were damaged permanently. No, it's just a little piece of feeling that you need to give them confidence. Confidence that love does still exist and it's not going to be unappreciated. Okay. Women and guys alike are now emotional. So if you've been hurt and you treat a guy a good guy, like if he were to be nothing important. He is going to do the same thing if he starts feeling like that. So please don't do that. Um, this video is going to be a little bit shorter because it, fortunately it is a big point. And a lot of the people I helped out go through the same thing. They unfortunately go through pain whenever they're in love with somebody. But that person nowadays just thinks sex is the choice. If they've been hurt, they can hurt. It doesn't work like that, guys. It doesn't work like that. Girls, the same thing. Love the person that... Try to take care of the person that's showing you sincere love. Don't have them just trying to do whatever you want. Appreciate them. Because once they're gone, and or once they've had enough, it's going to be bye-bye forever. So show them love. Be there for them because they're going to be there for you. That's what true love is. Trust. Companionship. Time together. Special time, special moments where you're going to be spending time with that person and you know you're going to be there. So, guys, take care of those people. Because sooner or later, you're going to regret not being there for them. And a lot of things nowadays, because of the sentimental things, lead to depression, guys. A lot of people have secrets and a lot of people have stuff like that. But if you don't open up to the person that cares about you, the other person that does not care about you is not going to is not gonna care about what's going on to you. Leading on to depression that will not be able to escape. So, guys... Don't mess, up, mess it up with the person that really loves you, that's been there for you. Not for an obsession, not for the cute girl, for the cute guy, for this and that. Yes. I'm not going to say just go for the ugly guy, because there's some ugly guys are stupid assholes. Uh, same thing with girls. But you got to learn when it's true love. When a person truly loves you, they'll be there for you. They may have obstacles once in a while, but they'll be like, they'll be willing to say, sorry, I can't do it. I can't go here because of this and that. Um, now, another thing I'm going to tell you guys, love that person. Because once it's gone, once that person is gone, you're not getting that person back. That person, there's always... A limit to how much a love can take before it quits on you. It don't matter if you're older, if you're if you're younger, if you're short, if you're tall, if you're fat, you're skinny, or you're ugly, you're pretty. Well, everybody can have a limit, and if you and if you break the limit of trust, there is no more that you can do.
So appreciate that person that truly loves you. Don't go on, don't go on appreciating every per, uh, the actual person that loves you. Because sooner or later that person is going to have to leave. And you're going to be left there alone. Being sad and thinking about yourself. Why didn't I trust this person? Why didn't I accept this person in my life? Why did I hurt him enough to leave? And that's going to lead to even bigger depression. So guys. Love. Don't. Oh, I appreciate it. I appreciate it. I appreciate it. Because once it's gone, it's gone. I'll do another video on time. But yeah. I'll be back in around a week or so. To make the next video. Or two weeks. I have busy schedule. So that's going to be kind of hard. But thank you guys for watching. And we'll watch out next time.